So the service we offer is really unique. We work um, in Dorset with our affected children and their family as a whole. So we offer community care and hospice care um, within our hospice setting. They play games, they go out in the garden, they've been down to watch the carnival, they sing, they do lots of arts and crafts. Just anything the children want to do, they try and make sure they get a chance to do it. They make sure they enjoy their time here. It's, you know, a godsend, really. We go into the house and we'll offer our services from giving the family a break. We'll be specially trained for that individual child. We'll do the medication for the family, and um, feeds or anything like that. Um, we also can go out with the child if it's all risk assessed. We can go on the slide, <laughs> zip wire, also swings. <laughs> We've got plenty of services that offer fantastic support for families. So the siblings can attend days out with our um, special sibling workers and volunteers. Sea Life Centre to Monkey World to London and then they do two residential trips a year. We offer the children overnight weekends once a year and hospice sessions so they can come in um, in the holidays, weekends and during the week. So they know their affected child is well cared for in the hands of carers and nurses. It's made an incredible difference to our family until you need the services of something like Julia's house you don't realize what they can offer and how they can help you it also helps our son and they've given him the most wonderful support one-on-one uh, -on -one, but also giving him the opportunity to meet with other children who are in a similar situation to him it's not medically orientated it's for the children it's a happy place and it's just somewhere to come and relax and enjoy your time any advice you need for anything medical with school any problems you get there it's a big weight off your mind to know that you've got somebody backing you up and that's there for you <laughs> where did you get that sticker and what will you say from Julia's house